Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for dropping by today. It is Friday the 14th of May and I'm just walking up Rigby Road. I'm actually on my way to work but you know that I work in Bispen so I'm not actually walking in the right direction to get to work. I'm going to take a little walk down the prom first. I've set up a little bit earlier because I'm just trying to think of different places to film whilst I'm on my way to work. So yeah, let's just walk through here. I mean most of these places I have filmed but I'm trying not to film the same place day after day. The other day when I walked to work I actually walked through Leighton and it was really good but the time I was walking through it was during the afternoon school run so it was super busy with parents and children and traffic so for the noise and the sheer volume of people I didn't film that walk but I will walk that way to work on Sunday so that will be my early Sunday morning vlog I'll walk to work and I'll go through Leighton so you'll get to see a whole different walk just over there just been looking at the Odeon that's going to be opening soon surely on the 17th because if the hotels are opening that means picture theatres are going to open as well, cinemas, movie theatres, whatever you call them. I don't go to a cinema that often, but every time I go I absolutely love it and then I think, oh I sh should come here more often. But I just end up not going again for ages. That is the bit of development where the new entrance was supposed to be built. That was going to be the new entrance to get into the leisure park and go all the way around there past the Odeon and lead to the new bingo hall when it was finished but as we already all know work has just been halted abandoned stopped whatever word you want to use there's nothing going on right now i have heard people have told me there is an opening date for that bingo hall so maybe work will start up again I guess the only thing I can do is keep an eye on it and as soon as I see something I will film it and you guys will be able to see it as well uh, we can see Banner Tines I used to be a member there I was a member there for ages and it was beautiful inside but I wasn't really getting my full membership value because half the time I was just too tired to go or too lazy to go or whatever excuse I want to make I used to like the body pump classes that is still my favourite class but yeah I haven't been to the gym in ages I can actually Noise. I can actually use the gym at work if I want. Well, right now, not right now, but under usual normal circumstances, I can. But not when it's busy. But yeah, let's head on to the prom. And we'll just walk down this bit of the prom for a bit today instead of just heading off on the north end of the prom every single time I am trying to bring a bit more variety into my vlogs so what news have I got for you not a lot I am getting my second vaccine on the 22nd of May which I'm happy about 
because my first one was in March so it's cool that I'm finally getting the second one Heidi's loads better in fact she's just chowing down on her food and eating normally now still mashing it up a little bit feeding it a really nice quality soft food got some little chicken fillets which I've been cooking and chopping up I got some salmon fillets as well which I chopped up for which she loved and those lovely treats are just because of people who have sent donations to my Kofi account and I just spent it on cat stuff so the girls because Trixie as well she's been included in all the treats it's not just Heidi I know Heidi's the one that's had the surgery but I can't leave Trixie out of the treats and also Bite McBitington he gets treats as well so yeah all the cats are doing fine now I'm back at work my full hours from next week so I'll be working my six days a week again that should have happened from this week but it's going to be happening from next week instead so yeah I feel like from my own personal perspective everything now is getting back to normal I'm starting to feel less tired walking up the Vispam and back I feel like I'm starting to get into my old self again it's been a tough old year I mean not just for me it's been a tough old year for all of us we've all lost people and friends or we know somebody who's lost people and friends but I do feel now that the light is at the end of the tunnel going to take a look in here yeah? I have heard that this is going to be starting up again soon and this development is going to actually be finished which should be really good yes yeah, so happy times so you get to finally hear a vlog from me when I was saying happy things instead of lamenting how bad everything is well, so I think the one video, Monday to Saturday, the day, is working a lot better for me. Definitely making me less tired. And I'm also thinking of having one video per week, or one day per week, when I do cat videos because I know a lot of you do like the cat videos and I do get asked for cat videos so I'm thinking of Monday to Friday the Blackpool vlogs Saturday or should I say cat a day could be cat video day and Sunday for well that will for now remain my day off I mean it won't be my day off work because I do work on Sundays but it will be a day off from posting a video so yeah this is south walking towards central prom I think I should cross over let's get across this road folks it's a nice day today and I've got my big coat on as well big wheels going round central piers open I want to do another big wheel vlog I really enjoyed the last one but if I do another big wheel vlog I'll take my daughter with me and she can film me while I talk to you guys on the big wheel that could be fun a few more people about on the prom today still quiet though there are the hotels on that side I do have 
an entire full prom walk video well it's in several parts but I did do a full prom video looking at every single hotel and building all the way from Stargate to Bispen so I do have that fairly recently got some seagulls there they've all flown off but none of them look like Barry anyway I'll let you all know if I see you Barry the big wheels going round see a lovely view of Central Pier there and the sea and the tower and from the 17th when the hotels open this is going to change it's going to be so much more busier going to be loads more people about there's so many people just who've missed Blackpool for so long and are dying to come back and from the 17th they'll be able to so that is fantastic just giving you folks a good look at everything on the prom have a nice pan across the sounds of the sea I love the sound of that summer tide just the way the water just gently laps at the steps just that sound it makes it's so lovely and relaxing and so nice I think now this will be the point where I just turn the camera off for a second until I get past the pier because if I'm recording while I walk past the pier I'm going to be hit with a copyright music strike so I will see you in a second when I'm past the pier and I'm back past the pier I can still kind of hear the music behind me but it's not loud enough to get me a copyright strike of anything to the beach patrol there driving past so I'm just going to finish this little bit of this vlog where I'm walking through this bit of the prom and then I will do the next bit somewhere else on route to work because I did quite like the format that I did the other week when I filmed the vlogging separate segments as a walk so you've got to see different things there's the golden mile amusements i like to get that on film all the time because it's not always going to be there because that's coming down in the new development we've got the rnli shop there and the lifeboat station That's where you put your contributions. Get a nice view of the tower there, look at that. That is definitely on my to-do list this summer. Film from Tower Floor. There's a little boat out there, I wonder if that's a lifeboat training or just fishing or I don't know what. Shall we have a zoom in? Oh, there's Barry. Dude, I wondered where you were. Is that you? Let me check his tail. Yep, that's my pal. There you are, mate. Yes, hello. I missed you. I was looking for you down there, but you weren't there. That's because you were waiting here for me, weren't you? 
you stay there Bazza and have a nice relax I'll just leave you there you relax down there for a bit and I am going to see if I can zoom in on this boat shall we have a look And there you go guys, that is a better look at that boat. Just a few seconds, but well, that's all you need. I'm stood right opposite it now. Ah, oh, that was further out than I expected. I thought I'd be able to zoom in better than that. There's a good view of the Sands building and the tower. There's a slightly younger seagull. Hello. They're really not bothered. They're so used to people, they just don't care. There's the frontage, the prom side, the west side of the New Sands Hotel. There's the old Wolvers building from the front. <laughs> and I think here, as I walk to Comedy Carpet, I am going to finish this part of this vlog and I will pick up my camera again when I get a little bit closer towards work so as we stand here and we look right up at the tower and the tower building and comedy carpet and the tower headland promenade I We'll be back again shortly with the next part of this vlog. So I will see you folks in a second. Hi folks, I'm back. I'm off the promenade and through town. And I'm on Devonshire Road again. And I know I've recently just filmed Devonshire Road for the streets of Blackpool. Well, I've filmed this half of Devonshire Road at any rate. So I'm not going to be doing a whole lot of vlogging here now plus the fact there's a lot more traffic on Devonshire Road on a Friday afternoon than there is on a Sunday morning so yeah not the best place to film and not the best time to film I've only really come back just to close the vlog out because I've wasted a little bit of time I went in a couple of shops to look for a couple of things which they didn't have and now if I walk slowly and do another vlog segment I'm probably going to be a little bit late for work so I am going to have to close this one out now so yeah thank you so much for watching thank you thank you to everybody who subscribed I've passed 5,000 subscribers now my next big target is 10,000 I really want to make that by the end of the year and hopefully my channel will start to grow a little bit faster now so maybe that will be possible but anyway thank you so much for subscribing thank you so much for watching
if you want to just help me out a little bit further and hit that like button please do so likes really really do help the channel anyway i'm signing off now so i will see all you folks in the next video goodbye